Hello, this is Onyx Tarot by Aubrey, and today I'm going to be doing a message for Capricorn. So thank you all so much for hitting the like button. I really do appreciate it, and it is super helpful to my channel. My personal readings are currently on sale just for a few days for Halloween, so feel free to check that out if you would like to book a personal reading. All right. Let's get a message for Capricorn. Message for Capricorn. All right. All right, Capricorn, we have the Six of Swords, Queen of Swords Reverse, Page of Swords, Queen of Wands Reverse, Two of Pentacles Reverse, Nine of Pentacles, okay, and bottom of the deck, is the magician awesome all right <clears throat> okay so the main energy here is the six of swords so the six of swords here it's just putting something behind you um <laughs> my windows open for fresh air so that there's a plane going by so some of you could be planning trips okay but really the six of swords is kind of like wrapping up all the things taking your losses where they are it doesn't have to be losses but just kind of walking away from somebody or thing or situation and starting the process of like closure now we have the queen of swords reverse queen of wands reverse so i feel like hmm Let's see. Okay. So yeah, I feel like you at the same time, there, there may be some type of blockage tied to you walking away from something because there's some type of, there's, <laughs> there's some type of clear green light ending. But I also feel like you may not be seeing it like that for some reason and we'll look into it in just a second page of swords though i feel like you are starting something new but then you may keep going back and forth as far as like believing that is really time to start something new and to move forward and to progress from a situation um and i also feel like you're I also feel like your belief or lack of belief in a situation that it will work out. Something the something about the way you're seeing things has to change. There's also something about you simply believing allowed you to manifest like exactly what you want. This is a situation where I feel like your spirit guides or the universe or God or whatever you believe in. It's like, we need you to be, um, I was on TikTok on like earlier and it was like, be delulu, like be delusional. Like, yep, this is what, <laughs> this is what I'm doing. This is what I'm manifesting. Like they need you to be in that kind of manifesting energy because it leaves with you in the nine of pentacles. And then what you don't see is a magician. So some type of manifestation is right, like right behind you. You don't see it yet. So this is kind of like your journey of like figuring out how to just kind of not work against yourself with your own thoughts, if that makes sense. <sighs> okay, so and then for some of you as well, that's, this is just for some of you. I feel like if you feel like somebody's like kind of sending you negative energy, um, that that alone could be what's trying to like affect you, but it ends up working out like your spirit guides your energy your higher power is like sitting and waiting for you to just be like to to like affirm something to the universe and affirm that things will work out and affirm that you know there's going to be some type of ending tied to any adverse situation that you're walking away from um let's go ahead and clarify the six of swords All right, so we have the main male, false person, great fortune, the lovers, community, 
and occupation bottom of the deck is change all right so yeah, um, you could be connected to somebody, a masculine energy, any gender, showing up as a main male here. This is somebody who has like created a lot of lie, lies. Wow. I don't know why I was trying to say lives. So this could be someone who has like, <laughs> for some of you, spread their seeds multiple places or in a fast amount of time or... You know, if this is like kind of a scammer, they created a bunch of businesses in a fast amount of time. Like something they've done is like very scammy. Now, this is somebody who um, they're about to experience a lot of changes. And I feel like they don't see it yet. What does this have to do with you, though? What is let's clarify the Queen of Swords in reverse. Queen of Queen of Swords in reverse. Message thief okay poverty unexpected income high honor wealthy man and then journey okay so i feel like this person is coming towards you with some type of <laughs> You know what this person has done, especially tied to money and status or something that you were supposed to receive. You have proof and documentation or you ha you literally have tangible proof and communication about this, all tied to whoever this masculine energy is. Now, the thing is, what you don't see is that you're going to be able to put this all behind you, but like there's something you're looking into before or as that happens now with this person this person this masculine is about to experience a lot of changes with their job um with how people see them as well um yeah their living environment some of the, some of you could realize find out that this person has lost a job like seriously what I'm getting is that there's a lot of changes that you like you just may not see it right now because you may be focused on um I don't know this person I'm hearing like the word harassing but basically in text email documentation letters and then on top of that they're like taking things from you trying to cheat you out of things leaving you with less than or leave it, making you fight for the things that are your own also the things that they are supposed to be giving you it's like they're playing games with you receiving this as well because it's directly tied to them or directly to, like there's a lot going on here but you're about to experience a lot of um you're gonna hear about a lot of changes with this person and whatever they have been doing with the house being in the reverse especially if this has to do with their work career or something that they do that is just like common knowledge um, that gives them stability. Yeah, there's gonna be a <laughs> there's gonna be a big shakeup for them coming up. Um, I want to clarify the page of swords. All right, so we have marriage, mature woman, journey, wealthy man, coffin, uh, family room, and bottom of the deck is courtship. So what I'm seeing is that the page of swords is like starting something new. You're going to have to study for it. You're going to, you're starting a new, I mean, it can literally be as simple as school or program or hobby or business or uh, travel or something you're looking into, right? And I feel like you are, mm, a lot of you are, <laughs> a lot of you are starting new new relationships and new partnerships which i feel like i've been picking up on or you're starting new business partnerships something with the courtship here somebody you like and i feel like you have a lot of your previous experiences to like better just like right behind your rear view mirror and this could be what you may not be 
you know, like super excited about like, oh, I got this new job offer, but I just left this like major thing where it was like such a big deal because I signed on with this place or because I got married or because blank, blank, blank. And then look how it turned out. Yeah, no, the universe is literally handing you your manifestation on a silver platter. And it's going to be really important that you almost like separate yourself from what is about to happen or as something closes or as you walk away from something or someone in the past um, so that you can just clearly walk into, you know, I'm hearing that follow the yellow brick, brick road like um, Dorothy from I think the Wizard of Oz. So yeah, what you don't see is the magician here. So something you've manifested tied to this reading is like literally you're about to like pull up on it but like I said um there's something that's happening as this happens okay and the universe kind of wants you to be in the right has the universe or whatever you believe in wants you to be in the right mindset in order to again welcome your blessing welcome your manifestation um so in the extended I'm gonna be looking into this house in reverse for this masculine main male energy also what they were doing with the false person and then also um also i'm going to be looking into what new what is your manifestation i'm going to be pulling tarot cards on that so you know exactly when it comes in and when it's going to come in as well and then some advice so feel free to check that out um you'll have access to this extended and all of the extendeds as well on patreon so feel free to join me there um, and also, if you would like to book a personal reading, the Halloween sale does end on Halloween. So feel free to check that out and see what readings that I offer. Okay, so thank you guys so much for hitting the like button, subscribing, and thank you for watching.